So welcome one and all to our live coverage of the ongoing group stage here. The tournament making steady progress towards its knockout phase. We'll be ready to go once the final checks are carried out. We have a hugely expectant crowd here. We just hope that the game lives up to the atmosphere. Certainly this is a very, very impressive venue, quite a sight to behold. The crowd rises for the national anthem of Germany. think this turns on Jim yeah Timo Werner he's quick and direct Peter loves to play on the shoulder of the last defender and he's always looking to make that run in behind I think having someone like that up front makes the opposition defenses think twice about playing such a, a high line and pushing them deeper can create space of course for midfield so he can be a real troublemaker well quite no argument for me on that one Now we're on the way. Sade. Has a quick glance. Lays it out to the flank. And the defence can get it clear. Back into the middle. Oh, he'll be annoyed with himself for not getting there. Drives it towards the front. Ginter does well there, alert. Gundogan. Gnabry. Rudy, Hector, Gundogan, no complaints about that challenge, robust but fair. Ginter, Kimmich, now it's Sané. Out to the left it goes. Gunnarsson with the slide tackle there. And here's Sonny. It's one! it away well there's a lot of movement out wide now yeah you can certainly see that well I think it's a move to open the game up more whether out wide or, or just getting a runner through the middle now gorgeous control there Sigurdsson And it's Bjarnason. Tries to dink it in. Lovely bit of skill there. Bjarnason. Out to the right. A chance to play it in. He's making good use of his strength, but Sigurdsson hits it! 
it's gone a long way up and away. Hoists it forward. Gundogan can get it clear. No goals as yet. Sané. It's well blocked and back out it comes. And it's played forward. Werner. Sane tries to stroke it through. Beautifully done. Regardless of the outcome, it is good to see someone running at the defence like that. And it's been taken straight back. And it's Sane. Gundogan. Sane cuts a frustrated figure right now, he just cannot get away. Look, he could do with someone else taking responsibility to shift the target. He badly needs some help here. Gundogan. And here's Canabri. Werner. Big chance! Oh, what a wonderful stop! Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A-plus grade. Forward it goes. Goals as yet. Cleared without complication. So here comes the substitution. Gnabry. And it's Sané. <laughs> Cleared away. Has a hit! Kimmich usually is so good from that range, he didn't quite connect as he can, though. Played in with accuracy. He's made sure that that won't get through. Hector. And we hit half-time, so now the team has broken through. But certainly not for the want of trying. It's been an interesting game up to now, but still goals. So there was the first half. Germany really did turn up the tempo at the end of the half and while they'll be disappointed not to have broken through obviously the chances will come provided they can keep producing good spells it's been a half with significantly more positives than negatives I feel interesting half just missing goals so don't be surprised if the second half brings a change to the scoreline at the break nil nil The scoreline doesn't back it up, but they've played with urgency and purpose and can't afford to lose patience in this second half. They've got to persevere. Gnabry. Gnabry spreads it towards the left. A really good feat. And he's there to clear it. Yeah, it's been intercepted and that will come to nothing. Gnabry. Sané. Tries to get it forward quickly. 
And he's there to cut it out. Sanic really got caught in a trap there, and he just couldn't get out. Oh, good interception. Werner goes for goal! They've scored! Werner with a predatory goal. Oh, players like this fella almost have a sixth sense to get themselves in such great coaching positions. How quick-minded was that? Germany have made their breakthrough, so can they build on it? Tries to get it forward quickly. Aimed in towards the centre. Sigurdsson shoots! Sané. This defence is, is wary about opposition pace. So they're just not getting too tight? Yeah, they know that if they, they step up, their, their keeper could get a whole lot busier. There are a few waiting for it. And they've been given a corner. Gundogan with the short one. towards the middle and it's hoisted clear well this looks promising got to make this count it's Sigurdsson somehow it stayed out Iceland are able now to make their substitution. It's been on the cards for uh, a few moments now. Hector. Werner. So, Jim, what are you thinking? There's a lot of football still to be played, Peter, so ideally they need to maintain a, an attacking endeavour. Forward it goes. Uh, ball needed to be better there, it's a wasted chance. And here's Sané. Sané plays it out to the wing. It's being played forward. And it's Gnabry. Gets it back. And the counter is on. Now then. He's found his man. Sigurdsson. Hits one. No messing about. Just bludgeoned away. Defending, but that'll do. Sane proves too strong there. The ball's loose, and he's after it. Gunnarsson. Gunnarsson takes the long option. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. Played out to the right. Mm. 
lovely feet. Germany are looking to make this one safe. They want to reduce the risk. So not long left in this now. Iceland look as though they are set to go out. Sané. And he just whacks it away. Germany probably could have killed things off, but they should be OK here. Germany just have to run down the clock. One good cross, maybe the last chance. Bjarnason tries one! Very speculative with little threat, if any, for the keeper. So that's it, it is all over. Germany, hold on. It's a narrow squeak, bit of luck, some judgment. 1-0 the score at the final whistle. So four points for nine, it leaves them right on the cusp and sweating on the group equation. Well, this game looked to have nil-nil written all over it, but credit to them, they upped their game in the end, and I thought they got what they deserved.